It'll be a long day for these fellas to just wow. We have got the matches coming back, but this match is going to be a little different. It's not only me and Steve. Yeah. We're taking on this dumb dumb over here, Mr. Brad Dukey himself, the good good labs man. I'm in a beautiful 2v1 straight up stroke play. Me and Steve are going to be in a scramble. Obviously, Brad's going to be playing his own ball out here at Gentle Creek. This is the first ever that we've done as a 2v1 on the Good Good Matches, and I'm excited. Yeah, we're trying to get a little freaky with the matches, so we might start switching it up a little bit. There will be straight up matches with people that are able to, like Juan and Luke, mm -hmm. but when they get a little freaky like this, you got to dial them up. Two people versus one. Let's run this. I'm up first. You got that, baby. Darn Skippy, get up there. That's in the bunker. Yeah, okay. So a little short, it goes a little bit right. That's what we're feeling, but that felt good. My chest, I hit chest yesterday. Keeps my, it take, keeps my body straight and compact because my muscles get bigger. I heard, okay. I heard that. Great first drive there from Steve. This will be the uh, fourth time I've ever hit this thing, so I need to, I need to hit it well. Wrong? Wow. No way we both. Yes! Yeah. Come on! What a shot. Give me some nuts for that one. I'm following Sharf's line. A little low ball. What do you think? You're a pro or something? Good shot. Good shot. Thank you. It's going to be a long day for these fellas. Just wow. Wow. Alright, what's going on everybody? Just wanted to stop and let you know that this video is sponsored by Underdog Fantasy. And obviously we know that the NFL playoffs are right around the corner. Garrett, what's going on? Yeah, Underdog Fantasy, for those of you that don't know, it's actually the easiest place to play fantasy sports. It's pretty simple. You can just pick higher or lower on your favorite player stats and you can win big money. Underdog offers easy and simple picks on your favorite sports such as football, basketball, UFC, mm esports, mm. golf, and Everything. more. Guys, again, it's very simple. You can pick whether your players have higher or lower stats, and you can win big money on this week's game. If you guys pick between two and five players, you can get a pick em entry, mm. and if you get all of them right, you can win up to 20 times your money. Isn't that crazy? That's pretty insane. That's insane. <laughs> nah, it's pretty insane. That's I insane. gotta be honest. Guys, Underdog is also available in 30 plus states, including California, Texas, and even Canada. Mm. That's not even a state. <laughs> last yeah, time I country. checked. That's a country last time I checked, but it is available in Canada, everybody. And obviously, with the NFL playoffs kicking off very, very soon, we're actually going to kick it over to Garrett, and Garrett's going to tell us his picks. Come on, Garrett, what do you got? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to tell you guys what I got. Uh, on this Sunday, I'm going to go for Dak Prescott, and I'm actually going to go him going under 280. 0.5 passing yards. I'm a big fan of the Cowboys. I just, I don't know why. I'm just feeling kind of the under. It's just like I got that little weird feeling. Sure. And I'm going to pair that. I'm going to pair that with Baker Mayfield to go over one yard. And guess what? All he has to do is pass for one yard and you win. Mm. It's pretty simple and it's a really good deal. If you guys are wanting to get in on it, get in on the action underdog fantasy. This is the easiest way to make money on the underdog app. All you got to do, click the link in the top description, use the code GOOD in all caps, and they're gonna actually double your first deposit up to $100 on Underdog Fantasy. That's Sharp, huge. what can they also do? They can also- They can actually also scan this QR code right here, everybody. It's right here in beautiful boldness. You can scan that, or like Garrett said, you can go check out the link in the top of the description. Again, big shout out to Underdog Fantasy for sponsoring today's video. This is gonna be exciting one. Me and Steven versus Brad in a 2v1 special first ever on Saturday matches, and I'm super excited for it. Love you guys, let's get right into it. Matt's in the fairway, I'm in the bunker, so is Brad. So we're off to a good start. The extra putts on the green is gonna be key, and uh, shout out to Underdog for sponsoring today's video. Actually sponsoring every match, Saturday match. Shout out you guys. I like my chances, you know. It's windy out here. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna call that they shoot two under, scramble. I'll shoot at least four under. Steve, you look like a caveman. You look like you're stuck in 1000 BC. Sharf, your hairline's worse than mine. 134, probably playing 150 something. I got an eight iron. All right. I want to kiss you. You know that song? Lady Gaga. <laughs> yep. Be good. Be good. Oh, dude, uh, it's, it's playing a full 150. It's playing a full swing eight. I don't, uh, not a full. Three quarter swing eight. Oh my 
my gosh! He's shorter than me. I said three quarters, big fella. Should've hit six iron. That's tough. Dang it! Too easy, Mike, too easy. I got 125 up here. I got nine iron. Hit a little piercer into the wind. Start off with a little bird. Take lots of greens when it's this windy, so got a bird chance. Make that, maybe they won't get up and down. Two shot lead, who knows? Who knows what might happen in this crazy world? Steve, what happened there? Laying my clothes, brother! I thought it'd cut through the wind, it just faded, but we got a quick up and down. I don't think he's gonna make that putt. Could be wrong. Hey, I'm never right usually, so we'll see what happens. You like that little spinny thing? Okay, thank you. You like that? Let's try and give us more of a tap in here, Michael. Good shot. Nice. Come on, Steve! Let him cook. Let, Let him, him cook. cook! Right, right there. You gotta stir it, but not stir it too hard because you don't want the grease and the crap to overflow in the stove. Winner's mentality. I got a downhill putt. 15 feet. Looks good to me. I think it's going in. I'll get your mark, Brad. Okay, thank you. I said, I'll, I what said, I say, Steve? Where's my mark? Right here! Oh! My mark is right here! I got your mark, big My fella. mark is right here! Hey, hey, hey come hey. over here! Hey. I literally hit right here, okay. brother. I have a feeling this you know match me. is going to be quick, I know painless, easy. Well. You know, there's the testosterone. You lose hair because you have testosterone. I got it. I got hair, but I have the, the brow bones. That means they develop quick. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what the hell you just said. <laughs> Don't three putt on the first. Good girl. Uh, All right. Bad yeah. speed. If I had good speed there, it's probably in the hole, but I didn't. So we'll see what they do. If I, if we, if I make this as true alternate shot, this hole. Yep. It's like you're still scrambling. Okay. Okay. Now here's the situation. <laughs> I missed the putt. Yep. Good putt. There it uh, is. Brad thought he had one, but he ain't got nothing, baby. Come on. The fact that we kind of struggled to make a par off the rip is kind of kind of sad, but hey, we'll take it. Next hole, we're gonna pound this man just like he's a piece of dough. Yeah. <laughs> what? All right, here we go. Par. You want us to do this? Yeah. What did you say? You want me to explain the hole? Huh. All right. Par. Par. F <laughs> it's a par five. It's a par right. five. It's a par <laughs> five. Number hole number two, 545 yards. Steven, come on, baby. We need right, a good I drive out of you. Good. All right. I'm gonna hit a little five. <laughs> 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 Five iron up the tee here. Yes. That's in play. That's not a play. I think I just hit the grandma that was cooking up some garden stuff. The driver's not feeling good, I'm gonna be honest. Dude, why am I playing with this? Why am I hitting the driver? The AI smoke makes this man feel good. Don't be in the bunker, it please bunker. don't be in the it bunker. It did? Yeah. I hit it over there every cub, time. Cub link, cub link's back. Yeah, into, into the rough, because we change lives around here. Yeah, you can. All, All right, hope you duck we it. change lives and we change lives. Hold it down. down. Hold it down. That's a slice. Keep going, keep going. Run, right. ball, run. Uh-oh, Brad. You're good. Oh, you're safe, but barely. Safe. Steve's feeling himself today. I got lucky here. I got in between the bunker and the out of bounds. I'm thinking about doing something real, real stupid. Real, real stupid. I don't know if this is gonna work or not, but I'm going driver off the deck. I'm on this upslope. I'm gonna open up the face, hit a big high cut. This is so dumb, but screw it. Yeah, I think I went bunker to the earth. Went to the next bunker. Damn, I didn't think I was gonna be able to cut that one that much with the driver, but I'm gonna have like a 100 yard, 100 yard bunker shot. Probably not the best spot. Just putting us in plane, I'm gonna hit the three wood massively. Come on, Steve. I'm just going for a layup. Okay. <laughs> Brother, you. Laid up. No matter how you do it, big fella. Well, I'm still gonna go three wood like an idiot. Oh, Michael, that sucks so bad. That's tough. That one hurts. That one hurts. Oh, what? Uh. <laughs> His 
bag, yep, Sharp's bag, and then Steve just has one putter in the bag. That's all he needs. <laughs> Here we go, seven iron, 154 yards. We're hitting a seven iron. Could even maybe get away with six. Need Steven to hit the screen. I got it. You're about to see a pure, pure, pure rain. Come on, baby. Well, let's get up. Let me see something. Let me see something. Yeah. I like okay, that. Okay, okay, okay. Let me see something. I'll take it. I like that. I'll take it. Hey, ain't no pressure. Ain't nothing but a horse fly. No. You trust in something. All right. That's a perfect swing. Gonna take some adjusting, I guess. That's on Brad, this is Brad's fault. I thought I was gonna have like an 80 yard bunker shot. It's actually only like 50 yards. I got lob wedge back into the wind. If I hit this correctly, it should have a lot of spin on it. But yeah, not the easiest shot. So, I bet you go up there, Mike, just in case it has some cool spin. I will. Okay, I'll see you soon. All right. I could putt this, but I, I might like a chip. I, I, I keep hitting and every club's off like literally this much. And I just, I gotta dial in my distances. That's the main thing. What? Release. Okay, so it goes left, it breaks left. Breaks left pretty heavy, just don't catch it heavy. Breaks a little left. Breaks a little left! Matt, the wedges, you know, I got that lesson from Brad. Everything else is going left, but them wedges, baby. <laughs> I got like 10 feet for my birdie. Pretty straight, not moving a whole lot. Maybe breaking a little bit left. Just to go one stroke up. It's okay, Steve, it's okay. It's all right. <laughs> Wait for that par three, big fella. Which one? What's gonna happen on the par three? We'll have to see. One down, Steve. Can't have that. We'll make a break on that. Right. You won't. Oh, 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 look at him go. Oh, he thinks he's so slick. One under. They're even through two holes. Like I said, I think they're going to shoot one or two under. I'll sneak a couple birdies. I thought, well, that hole is kind of tough today for tougher than normal. I'm going to guess I'll birdie one of the next two holes because it's downwind. I'll do one under through four. And I just need to shoot three or four under. Nothing crazy. One under through two. Can't wait to see the tears coming down Steve's face in the end of the round. 382 yard par four, downwind, downhill. I'm going for the green. I'm swinging hard. That's going to be a hard up and down. Right in the bunker. All right. Should be in the bunker, I think. Easy up and down. Easy bird. All right. I'm going to hit the green. Keep it on that left side, Steve. Looked a little better, but I can't get over these rights. I'm on that left side, which I like, but hopefully it's not in that tree trouble. Well, the boys look like they're a little screwed here. Just wait till they see it. Hold it down. Oh, that's not bad, Steve. You got a four or five. We are chilling. Neither one of them will let the green here. Neither one of them. I bet you five bucks they will. Okay, deal. 71. 71 yards here. Um, luckily, like I said, it's not in tree trouble. These trees ain't got no business. They ain't got no business being here, so. Me and Steve, a little 70 yard chipper, right next to the hole, Steve, come on. Yes, you do. I thought that was close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought that was so close. What the? Okay, go ahead, clean that club. All right, now we just gotta get it over the bunker. <laughs> what you, what do you, what'd this man say over there? Nothing. Okay. Yeah, you got it. Oh yeah, you got it. Who said you didn't have it? Okay, we got a birdie putt. Okay, that's what we need. We need chances. Woo! Chances. That was close. Tough shot. We got ourselves a birdie putt. Hopefully Brad doesn't give himself one of those. You got Venmo? <laughs> I'll send you my Venmo. Okay. That's how easy it is out here to make five bucks. You know how you can get money easier than that? Underdog fantasy. Underdog fantasy, baby! Way easier to make money on underdog and you make, make a lot more too. True. A lot more than five bucks. True. Greenside bunker here. A little down slope, but all in all, pretty easy shot. Lots of green to work with. 
it's all uphill once it lands on the green. Expect to hit this one close. We'll work there. Okay. And, uh, I got away with that one. Two great putts at birdie here. We got 18 feet between us and victory. Brad's got himself a birdie putt as well, so we're gonna need to drain this one. We are. Oh. Okay, a little low. Matt, you idiot! That's alright. That's good. Three, two. <laughs> that was those terrible. That was a terrible putt. I, I, I. That was bad. I bet you five bucks he makes it. Sure. That's 200 through three there, even through three. Two shot lead, six holes left. All right, higher or lower 0.5 fairways hit between the two of them. You'll take higher? higher go okay, all right, five bucks? Five bucks. Okay. Come back and bite you all that talking you're doing. Go ahead. Okay. All right, number four, 456 yard par four, dead down win. I'm gonna swing hard at this one again, just go right of that bunker that's in the middle of the fairway. Oh, shite. Uh-oh. Did I just hear a, a door open? Yes, you did. Did it slam open or was it Might be out, brother. It depends. Nah. Re -tee. All right. I will. Don't worry, Steve. I hit a good one. You're chilling. No, no, no. I, I got to get my swing feeling better. I'm going to do a long drive, which keeps the ball straighter. The starter, I swing for some reason. Hey, sometimes that does happen. I'm not going to lie. The harder you swing, the straighter it goes. All right. Come on. Just peeling off that bunker. Stay left to the bunker. Stay left to the bunker. It's right in it. Short. Oh. Might be short. Might have rolled to the left. You like your body's going at it. Wow. Go! Big kick. 400 yard kick. 400 yard kick! Go ahead and hit that ball again. Okay. Okay, now I'm figuring it out. You aim a little left and it goes a little right. Mike, this is provisional. Yeah, it is. It's going to be the ball you take, but I like your confidence. <laughs> one right too how about we do that <laughs> that's that's literally gonna be like a wet shot all right Brent, go for your first one. Oh. Woo! come on baby <laughs> i'm in all right 35 from there i lost my range finder in la left it on the cart at one of the courses couldn't find it. Uh, 35 from there, so probably 42 from here. Dead down wind. I'm going sandwich, 56 degree. All right, 15, 20 feet. That for a little Turk, three in a row. Come on now. Dang, Brad, this looks like fairway to me. Yeah, that's uh, that's that's higher than 0.5, so. So the five dollars in your pocket. They make a bet on it, Steve. Let's I know. Go. I know. That's hey. The bets aren't gonna be made after we tap this in. Why did I hit that like a baby? No. Why did I hit that? Why did I literally hit that like I wasn't swinging? Is that fifty-four? Yeah. Yep. How, how we think it? Go in. Go in. Wow. What? Oh, that doesn't take a bigger off than that. All right. Come down to the putting. All right, it was right at the pin though. Alignment felt better. See, my divot is actually aimed at the pin, a little after the pin even, so that's good. Alignment's working. Come on. Higher, lower, sharp says alignment. Thrust around. Three and a half. Yeah. So you're going lower? Yeah. We got up the hill with the pressure on. I hammered it, dog. No. Wow. That shot, and it doesn't move very much. How I ended up right. I, I mean, I'm not giving them any reads. I'm giving them, giving them blind shots, pretty much. <laughs> Why you gotta put your hand up? I don't know how that doesn't go in. <laughs> Steve went. <laughs> That's getting posted. posted. That's getting posted everywhere, you ding dong. That one was on me. I, I talked no, it out. No, how did I leave it short? That's on me. Yeah, that was. Brad's got another, dude, I hate how he's built. Uh, he just got another chance though. It's for a little Turk. Come on, baby. Need to see it. You so Handsy. 
pulled it, didn't hit it. That's all right. 200 through four, they're still even through four. We're getting back into some, into the wind holes, so it's gonna be a little tougher. Higher or lower, 0 0.5 balls on the green from their team. Higher. That's a bad one for me, but yeah. I need to give some of your money back. Yeah, I know, you're, you're raking it in right now. All right, 163, dead into the wind, number five. I got seven iron, wind's blowing pretty good still, so it's a little chippy seven, right at it. That was a really bad swing, but I saved it. I got seven. Weird swing, but I, I kind of saved it at impact. Mill green, not a bad shot into the wind today. He hit it pretty full, Steve. Hit a turtle and bounce on the green. Matt, that's a nice uh, beanie you got on. Where'd you we, get it? At uh, a little store called googlegolf.com. Okay. They should go check it out for all this apparel we're all rocking right now, so. A little online boutique store? Yep. They got great antiques in there. Okay. Boutique, <laughs> antique, same thing. Thank goodness for sharp, dog. Where's my right? That's gonna be a little short, ain't it? All right. All right, Sharp. We're putting, but it's short. Hey, the aiming is doing great, Brad. Yeah. Aiming's better. Like, I just, you know, just got to get that small thing figured out where I'm aiming maybe a little too far left. But I think that one's pretty solid. Yeah. Okay, said, I, lost, I lost five bucks there because he hit the green, right? But he didn't yeah. say alignment. I know, he kept saying aiming. Say alignment, Sharp. No, aiming's good. No, I, no. Yeah. But not for, you took the over, you took the higher. I took the lower. 3.5. Oh, yeah. So that's bad for me though. No, it's very good for me. It's bad for me. Sure, but good so overall. I want to say overall, a, it's very say, good. Say alignment. No, say aim. <sighs> aim is better. He it's said aim. He said aim. More concise. He said aiming like nine times there. But alignment is like three syllables. Aim is one. It's just easier. It's BS. It was a little chilly this morning. We worked it back a little bit though, didn't we? Matt's been carrying. I, I'm not. I'm not all here. We got to putt. What the hop? Okay. No! I thought that was in the last four feet. What that hit? Great putt though. Why, why'd you put it there? That, that thing saved you. That Go. thing's gonna be like two feet low. Hit a little walnut. No! It looks like that's, I'm like aiming up by that leaf. That's a great par for me and Steve, so we we'll obviously need Brad to miss here. I think he's gonna make this. I can say this with 199.9% confidence. <laughs> what did I say? Uh oh. Confidence uh, uh oh, we got a little work left, Steve. I need to see that. Oh, that almost bounced that out. Did what almost bounce the? Out. He that would have so been funny as hell. All right. <sighs> what a bad putt. Yeah, what a terrible guy. All right. Low all the way. You're still two up. I still yep. don't like that. Yep, I love it. Me and Steve got some work to do if we want to come back here. We got a beautiful par five. Probably gonna have to make Eagle to beat Brad, but let's do it. Number six, par five, 499 yards. Dead into the breeze today, uphill. Should still be able to get it there easily in two with a good drive. I'm gonna go for a little low draw here. Yep. Yeah. Again, very just weird feeling swing, but it worked out. All right, here we go. Just over those bunkers low. <laughs> it's over them bunkers low. Hey, what was that? I slipped. What are you doing? I gotta see that video. I slipped. <laughs> I said, try to feel like you're aiming left. Man said, I. The ball started on the hell. I mean, to be fair, he slipped like a mother he did trucker. He slip really bad. All right, well, Steven's obviously out here. I gotta hit a good one. Gotta try and keep it in play here. Okay, come on. Don't say it, 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 don't say it. That's one. It's in play. Go, go, go. All right, on that left side should be all right. It What's the farthest happened? distance you can slick back? Farthest distance I can slick back? Yeah. Oh gosh, I'm gonna be out of breath. Can you go to bat and Steve? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> He's like doing the ho 
slow down or like something. <laughs> 235 yards, middle of the green. Pins in the back is probably 250. Uphill into the wind. I got through it. I think it's all I got. Dude. Dude. That's gone. That's gone. That ain't gone. See ya. That ain't fine. I'm in another one just for provisional. I think I'm fine. Boy, that's a bad swing. All right, it's provisional. Much better. Gosh, it's at the top. I keep getting a little collapsy. I'm gonna just get steep. Come around top of it. I think the first one's gonna be in. Jump down for birdie. Hey! Dang, that sounds like That's like uh, zombies. Yeah, it is. Yeah, the Rago, Rago, Rago. Rago, he gone, she gone, his ball, he gone. How we doing? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Don't try. <laughs> It ain't, it, thought my driver was gone. It ain't nothing. It ain't nothing that but a thing. Right Why, see, here's the problem. If we could have a freaking club here other than just a putter, that'd be great. I'd cook a little bit better. I'd be whipping. I'd have that freaking duck fat boiled up, boiling. All right, DOD, baby, come on. <laughs> What'd that do, Len? I topped it, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot! You are sucking. What the heck, dude? What I? Mike is here to attest that I'm not dropping these balls. I think is that it? Yeah, that's it. Right there. I might be screwed. I'm about to dally whack this thing or something, but I'm in. That's all that matters. Oh my! Solid contact. I think there's a bunker there. Wow, that, I didn't think I was going to be able to get that much club on it. You take a club length or what? You cheating? No. Okay. I could have been in the perfect spot. 99 yards. Get back there. Get back there! I don't mind that. Get a drive and a top. Let's be better on this one. Am I too far? Am I aim now? I'm, adjust, I'm obviously aiming too far left. I doubt you're aiming too far left. I'm sure you're just still coming over a little bit. Really? I mean that. I can, I can take the next turn. Yeah, please do. Because it feels that feels phenomenal. That's a great swing. Okay. All right, here we go. Come on, we got to make that for birdie. Can you just say alignment one freaking time? He said it like eight times in the first four holes. Now he's saying aiming. That's just, that's just good game sense for me, though. Every, you have a good feel of the round. Yeah. He can't be hot every like every hole. Yeah. He has to slow down at some point. Look at that! I like that! Hey! Alright, I'm making this. Dang, that's way too good. Ain't no thing. Ain't no thing. Land it right on that leaf. That's you won't learn how to do the bunker shot with one foot in the bunker. Good, good labs. 21 feet to victory. We get a shot back here. That was a phenomenal. Oh, I thought he did it again, ladies and gentlemen. Real I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't hit a more firm, perfect putt, leaving it about two and a half feet by. Perfect pace. Idiot! All right, still two back. There you go, Sharp. Shut up. Oh, thanks. Oh. Still two back. 407 yards. Wind is mostly off the right, a little into. I'm gonna aim out to the right. Try to hit a little draw that the wind takes. You gotta put a good swing on it. No more collapsing up top. Gotta stay extended. Keep that width, you know? Oh no. Sit down. Simmer down. Oh, I actually hit that one really solid. Just did not have the, the old draw on it. It's all right, it's safe. Probably not in the best spot over there in the trees. Line but we'll eight. figure it out. You ready for a big daddy drive? Comeback time? Oh. We need to. We got three holes left and we're down two. Stroke play though. That's a fair point. How? Okay, all right. Hey, how does it even do that? It's okay. It's okay, it's okay honey. Why? Need a good drive, Steve. I mean, you just go over that little mountain. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just it's that simple. The fairway's huge. There's okay. No way to miss it. Okay. There ain't a way to miss it. That was wet. Go. Anywhere around that tree spot. Yeah. That was hit really well, Michael. Me again! Come on, baby. That's huge. We gotta get some strokes back on this guy. Come on. Yeah, I'm going straight over, I think. I don't know how far it is. I really wish I had my range finder. Who has to find sprinkler heads these days? All right, 111, probably about 92 to the pin, we'll say. All right, all right. It's kind of a guesstimation with the sprinkler head. I got law budge out. I'm gonna try to just hit kind of like a sneaky flop over this tree. I could go under, but the bunker's just sitting right there in the way. So yeah, just a little high 60 degree, hopefully plops right down next to the pin. Go hard. Go hard. All right. I thought that was gonna land the bunker for a second and it 100% would have plugged if it had. But it carried, and that's on the front edge. It got like 15 feet. I will take that from that spot. Look at this drive. This is my furthest drive and potentially one of the furthest drives I've ever seen on this hole. So that's huge for Mr. Short Sharp. Hey, Steve, or see that? That's for his birdie. Yeah. Wake him up. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm, we're not gonna need a putter because we're gonna tap in with the wedge. Come back a little bit. Work it, work it. Not bad. Interesting. I, I'm, I uh, the one thing, we gotta take the positives. I ain't chunked one yet today. You, like, you wanna aim right here because naturally it looks like it's gonna come up that that right side and kind of funnel back towards the hole, but we kind of hit it a little long and I don't like that. We got that for birdie, Steve, come on. I got like a 20, 25 footer up the hill. Pretty simple looking putt. I got to count on one of them making their putt. They just got like five or six feet and two chances at it. So most likely I got to make this to keep my two shot lead. This is going in, Steve. Shut up. I put a thousand on you, brother. Make it. And that bet was wrong. Why are you talking? Why are you talking? <laughs> that one was bad. Hey, I get good butter, brother. I can't say anything. I just knew I was gonna make that one. Walk it down. <laughs> That's it. That's it. You're done. You are literally down. so done. Did you lock it down? I said walk it down. Oh. Dude, golf ain't it today. Right edge, a little bit of pace. That was not edge, brother. I was outside the hole. <laughs> hey, good match. <laughs> How? A three footer. Good playing. Fun match. Psych, we still got two holes left. I ain't, I ain't done yet. I'm hitting the green on this next one. Got him right where I want him. 376, down and win. The smart play, a three shot lead, would be the layup, but I'm not doing that. I'm going for the green. Position A, position A. Let me say, I mean, there, our performance is poor. Okay, we missed the, we missed the four footer. I am not even mad about that either. Honestly, that's it. Just happens. Yep. When it's at when when you're outside of ten feet, it's just like it's hard to get in it's the hard hole. To, yeah, it's hard to connect it. Go, go, get over the tree. Get over the tree. That could be really good or really bad. That should be too. that should be fire. Very that should be really good. good. Yeah, that should be money. I'm so upset with myself. That's so bad, man. I'm just, I can't be getting a read like that and then, <sighs> mm. All right, it's behind us. Gotta try and hit the green here. How's that cutting? How, how are you cutting? That'll be fine. I was expecting my little draw I had on the last hole, but didn't get it. Come on, Steve, we gotta make an eagle. We gotta make miracles happen now, brother. This has to go in, because Brad's freaking how about we make a birdie? What's the yardage? I, I, 72 I, yards. I'll be honest, I don't think if we put it within an inch, we're making a birdie. <laughs> like, I, that's the point we're at. 72 yards, though. 72 yards. Come on, Steve. Be that guy. Kick hard, funnel left. Kick hard, funnel left. Kick off! We needed it so bad! No! Ah! We needed it. That's 250 pounds, big fella. I thought that was thin. I was like, no freaking way, bro. I've been hitting so many lips recently and those wedges you just keep it compact like you're just oh it's like a I imagine you have a pancake on the bottom of your on your on your club face and you're just keeping it balanced you know good good laughs <laughs> hey woo steve come on now hey guess what that ain't for birdie <laughs>
<laughs> yep, that sucks! How we doing? That sucks! We suck around here. How we doing? I had the angle, like whenever Steve spun, I like checked up and started rolling left. I thought it was in for sure. Put my hand up and everything, but it missed by like an inch. Uh, I'm down here right next to the front edge of the green. I'm gonna chip it. Hopefully get up and down for a birdie. Get a four under. Stay low, Gotta stay get low, that up stay right, low. Brad. Uh, go. Go! That was bad. Bad, bad, bad. I was focused on good contact, which I got the contact how I wanted. I did not play that near high enough. It's all right, let me make that. I'd I like would to say this is in for Steven. It's not, because this is further than we had last time. Yeah, it is. It's actually six feet. Crazy, because if he misses this, we actually had a chance. <laughs> <laughs> I love this putter. I love it. Look how pretty it is. Seven. I'm about to shoot seven under on these fools. Hmm. Meanwhile. It hurts when you know the outcome. Like that's what hurts the most. What? When you already know what's gonna happen. What? Dude, we've had, that was it. We've had three good looks at birdie. Missed them all, and we that was good. Let's go, final hole. I can't do this, Michael. I can't do it. The only thing that could redeem me right now is, an, is a hole in one in the next hole. And we'd still lose the match. And that, at least you go out with a little bit of dignity. And that's what we need right now. We've got no birdies. We've got no victory. We've got no success. And I got an idiot in the car. I actually can't believe it. Nah, Steve, shut your mouth. You know, I might be losing the alignment bet, but I'm beating two guys by four strokes, so it's worth it. Here, here and that coming from their cart, it's worth it. Like, I just, the day golf day, I think if we made a hole in one, it literally probably wouldn't count, I'm gonna be honest. Be a hole in two. Yeah. Go in the hole, please. Please go in the hole, Fast Brad. Dunk it. Oh my gosh! I thought that was gonna, I thought that might dunk for a second. That would have been the craziest Damn. one whatever. <laughs> oh, sit. Oh. Sit. Oh, right that, in the hole. That time. Oh. Yeah. Alright, I got a little eight piece. Come on. Did that chunk it? No, that's perfect. Yeah. Shot. Shot. Probably gonna miss that one. <laughs> Had a little line up there from Steven and Brad. Felt like I was coming in from the inside there. Came to perfection and now we have maybe a chance to make our first birdie of the day. <laughs> Gosh dang it, Sharp. Just say a line. He said a line. He said lined up or line, well, line a, up. I think he said a he line said, as well. No, he said, he said line up. Well, I, I mean, a line wouldn't be the word either. That's a BS. We're in for par. Yeah, I can putt there. Do suck. What are you, 400? Yeah. <laughs> uh, we'll make our first birdie of the day. Please! I got this, I got this. We've done it. Shouldn't have said it. We're really cold today. We're tough. <laughs> it's on you, big fella, to make us a bird. Yeah! Yeah! Sharp! Yeah. 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 Sure. Yay! We only lost by three. Well, it'd help if you had your clubs. It'd help if I had my putter. This is luckily Brad had a putter I could use. We kind of forgot all our stuff, but regardless of that, I had some really, really bad iron shots that I missed working on that alignment. It's helping me swing it a little better, which is good, but it's tough to compete with uh, under par. You know, for under for Brad, he played phenomenal. Great score, great playing, good win by Brad. You gotta come out and you gotta play well when you play him, you know? Yeah. Uh, him and Luke both, they, they come out and they can compete, especially in windy conditions. This is where they thrive. It showed from Brad. This is why he's the leader of laps. Yeah, I forgot it. it. Great I, didn't, I, had the, I didn't have an earring in my right ear this whole time, so that's all me. What? That was a lot of fun. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy that video. If you did, stay tuned for more good, good extras and good, good content and good, good labs from good old Brad Dalkey himself. Um, it should be just right around the corner. So, and big shout out to Underdog Fantasy. 
for sponsoring this video. Underdog Fantasy is the easiest way to play fantasy sports. So big shout out to them. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. We'll catch you in the next one. Till next time. Love you guys. Peace. When you said alignment, it, uh, like, it took me a couple seconds and I realized. I look at you, you're like. <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping, I, I thought about egging him on. I was like, maybe I can egg him on and say it like three or four more times. <laughs>